Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Fable 2. Alright, when we left off, I was uh, not over here, but uh, on my way back, I found that apparently I can now open this, so now we're going to open it. There we go. And... Potion of Life. The same sect of old kingdom alchemists who, uh, who are said to have solved the secret of immortality also created this recipe for this life-prolonging potion. Few have the knowledge or the skill to brew it successfully now. So we're just going to drink that and uh, increase our health bar a little bit, which it's not noticeable now, but we did. Alright, and uh, I would went up there to... Uh, Try and see if I could buy some cool things and whatnot. I couldn't. Oh well. <laughs> I tried, and if there was anything I was going to show you guys, and nothing. I. Or maybe you can just shush? Because I don't need to buy you nothing? The House of the Ghostly Puffin. What the. The hell is. Locals believe this house to be haunted by the spirit of a long-dead Puffin. Rather than frighten its residents with nightmares, however, the Puffin is said to bring extremely peaceful and restful dreams. Alrighty then. That's a thing. Uh, what is this? Health regeneration. That seems useful. <laughs> that seems very useful. The day alchemist Leo Head bought the ha uh, bought this house, the people in Power Stone rejoiced, for they knew the renowned alchemist's inventions would benefit them all. Here he experimented with the potions that eventually led him to be wealthy enough to build what is now known as Castle Fairfax. That is actually pretty cool. I might buy that to move in. Yep, I'm gonna buy that to move in. With a dashing title. With a dashing title, huh? I'm going to go to the cellar and see what there is because I own the building next to it. As far as I'm concerned, I own what's in here. So let's see what's in here. Ah, a pretty necklace. Isn't that nice? Okay. Is that it? Is that all that's in here? Looks like it. Okay, well. At least I got a pretty necklace. Okay. Uh... I own this house, so that's a cool thing. <laughs> that uh, regeneration bonus the is going to be great. Brightwood Farm, Brightwood Farm. yeah. That's a thing that we'll get to eventually. Oh, the nice house. I forgot about the nice house. It's got do-gooder, purification, and animal magnetism. This was once the home of Lavender Nice, a woman as famous for her kindness as for her astounding beauty. Despite having hundreds of suitors, she was far too pure to marry. When she disappeared, still young enough to retain her looks, it is said that she had ascended to a higher plane of existence. Well, here's hoping, because that, that would be tragic otherwise. Okay. There's a lot of good benefits out of this one. Then again, health generation is also pretty damn oh, great. Naughty. W what do you mean, naughty? I didn't do anything. What do you mean, naughty? What are you trying to say? Okay. All the styles you could possibly want are available, <laughs> are available, available here. I can't talk today, apparently. But I can buy this shop. So I'm going to do so. Ha! The property is mine. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna see. There's that building there. This one led to just a little garden here. I'm just I'm just checking around trying to uh, you know, increase the revenue stream. That's all. That's all. Why are you talking to my dog? Why are you talking to my dog? What is here? A bit of skirt. 
That made my sentence sound far weirder than I intended. <laughs> What's over here? A bit of skirt. Alrighty then. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? I could use the money from this. You can't get engaged without a ring. I'm not intending to get engaged, period, buddy o pal. Okay, wow, the blacksmith costs a lot, but then the revenue is probably pretty good as well. Okay, let's look at the blacksmith again. Just to double check. Yep, nothing. Nothing useful. Stalls will close until tomorrow. Yeah, 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 I figured. I figured it was inevitably going to happen. Yep. And they're closed. Uh... There we go. I cannot afford to rent this out, but it's here. <laughs> I'm just checking around. No, no. No, I should probably move on. I did a lot of uh, buying and running around last episode. I remember that. I. Okay. That was. hot under the collar. Okay, can we not? Can we not, please? Can we please not? Jeez. You, <laughs> you might as well use a toy slingshot, you big baby. Okay, where are you? Where are you so I can shoot you? Oh, doggo noticed treasure somewhere. Okay. Okay, that's Scottish. That's Scottish little shit. It's going to be the death of me. Okay, what what are you barking at? Where's the treasure? Oh, there it is. Okay. Well, we took care of that. <laughs> and a beginner's guide to business, which I don't need. Money bag for 200 gold. Alrighty. Hi, I'm just admiring your shoes. You, you, you're just admiring something. I'm sure it's not the shoes because you've been following me this whole time. Okay. At this point, yep, there's nothing I can do over that way. And I'm not seeing this Scottish gargoyle over here. Oh, but there is stuff up here. I forgot about going up here. I forgot that there's stuff in this general direction. And a money bag, 200 gold. Yep, that, a pittance, but it's a pittance I will take. Up, and what's over here? Ah, emerald. Gotta get those emeralds. Oh, I can hit you, all right. Watch, bitch. Yeah? Pfft. I'm sorry, you've seen more brains in a what bucket? In a what bucket? Can someone who's Scottish please translate what the fuck this, these things are saying? Please. Me as the humble, stupid American. I don't understand. <laughs> humble, stupid American. Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure how that works, but okay. Okay, where's the fucking gargoyle? It's somewhere over here, but I cannot figure out where. What about... <laughs> what? <laughs> Alright. The, the, the one thing I've learned about a lot of this game is that the Scottish are, are ridiculous... Okay. Crackpot than a crack shot. That one was good. I'll admit, that one was a good one. Okay, a dog noticed something. Over this way. Dig spot, okay. And there we go. Let's see if I can grab it. Before I head off to the thing I'm supposed to be doing. And I'm putting off because I'm hunting things and buying things. 
Mago's big book of trading and that. What are you doing this? later? You know, tonight. Um, not you. But that seems to be your plan. So, um, bye. <laughs> uh, jeez. Why? Why do they always come on to me? I'm not that pretty. I swear. Okay. Let's head back to Bower Lake. Uh, there we go. That's what I wanted. And let's see if there's any treasure and whatnot that I can probably pick up here. Oh. What are you... What are you barking at? Oh. Oh. Something going on here. Okay. Okay, jeez. Okay, this is not going well. Okay, come on, you little shit. Take your lumps. Come on. Really, you were taking these all in stride. That was something else. That was something I did not expect. Oh, I didn't sleep in the regeneration place. Oh, man. Well, I'm going to have to live with that. Uh, so they were defending this way. Don't know why. What do we got over here? Oh, is this a thespian appearing in our midst? Nope. Someone who has experienced life who can compliment my words with a worthy performance? Nope. I am Albion's finest tragedian. Yeah. Author of 7,452 plays. That's a lot. I am now putting the finishing touches on my crowning masterwork. Okay. Perhaps you could assist me. Nope. I do not have enough. I know that for a fact. So uh, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm going to go this way, run into that route for a bit, and then I'm going to continue going this way. Bye-bye. I have absolutely... Not enough. I know that for a fact. Oh. Ah. There's that. There's that. Is there any more? I swear there was more. There had to have been more. Oh. My controller died. <laughs> Give me a second. Ah. Uh, I think. Yep, it's back. It's back now. Maybe. Uh, come on. Oh, and it died again. <laughs> Give me just a moment. There we go. Okay. Perfect. Damn, this, <laughs> the gun does more damage than my spells do. That's not great. Anyway, yeah, it's been giving me the uh, death whales of your batteries are running low for like the last day but I just uh, I just like running my batteries until the uh, juice is gone yeah that, that's a weird phrase out of context but yeah that, that was pretty much it Ooh, there's a, a traitor light weapons traitor huh want to talk to you always a pleasure to serve oh is it a uh, steel cutlass. That's uh, not worth picking up. Hello. I'm sorry. You're from around here, are you? No. Well, I mean, technically I am, but uh, not too much. Oh, hey! There we go. Kind of want to get my will up a bit. There we go. Okay, time to roll. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. That was that was great. That was nice. I love that. Is that a bird or is that a It's hard to tell. Butterfly. Maybe. Uh bird or a butterfly? It, it's one of those anime questions. Is this a pigeon? Okay, there's something down here. Got him all riled up in a tizzy. Oh, hello. We're gone. Okay, they have the gargoyle yelling at me. Okay, come on. 
Come on. There we go. Come on. There we are. Whoop. You shit. I thought you were dead. Kiss my stony ass. Okay. Alright. That's enough out of your fucking mouth. Thank you. Jesus. Okay, well, that was a thing. Why are there so many goddamn beetles? The red ones seem to be the weakest out of the bunch. Or at least I can kill them in one shot with a pistol. The rest of them were, uh, not so much that. Or at least the blue ones weren't. I wonder what the blue ones were about. Was I supposed to strike those? I don't know. Not a clue. Huh. I wandered over here thinking, oh, I could pick those mushrooms, and then I remembered, oh, wait, no, I can't. What game am I playing? Oh, yeah, not that one. That my brain decided, oh, that's a thing. Fuck if I know. All right. Let's, uh... Oh, wait. Not that way. I need to go this way. Because this one is the faster method to get into the guild place. There we go. Up we go. With the bunny! <laughs> Sorry. I could not resist. Okay. Away we go. Just making sure I don't fly off the edge, which is entirely possible, given that it's me. Use the Kellis Gate to the Chamber of Fate. Use the Kellis Gate to the Chamber of Fate. That rhymes. That rhymes, and I'm pretty sure they did not intend it to. Alrighty. We back. Me back. There you are. Yep. I believe the second of our heroes, the mage, is in Brightwood. Brightwood. There is a powerful will user there called Garth. Oh, yeah. Do you remember that name? He was there the night Lucian killed Rose. You don't have to remind me of that. You didn't tell me that. How are we supposed to trust him? Yeah. Garth believed Lucian's interest in the Old Kingdom was purely academic, like his own. And Lucian, for his part, thought Garth was merely a brilliant scholar. When Fair each enough. learned the truth about the other, their partnership ended. Violently. Well, that's... good. You will find Garth in Brightwood Tower. I have seen a vision of him toiling on some ancient technology there. Oh, really? Surely he intends to stop Lucian, but he cannot do so without help. Go and inform him of our intent. Fair enough. We shall do so. Or by we, I mean me. Hammer, you should remain here. Because, yeah, that... Why? I'm ready. With Lucian still searching for heroes, it's safest for you here. She's got a point. Fine. But don't think you're holding me back when the action starts. Well, I don't think she'd dream of that. My father thought his faith would protect him from the world. Yeah. I won't make the same mistake. Fair enough. Go now. Okay. I shall do so. So bye bye. To stay here with Mrs. Barrel of Laughs while you go off into the world. Great. You probably shouldn't complain that loudly. I mean, she's blind and not deaf. Just saying. Okay. <laughs> Let's use the Cullis Gate back to Bower Lake. And. Okay. There we go. I was about to say, the load usually doesn't take that long. Alright. Oh, I could vault from here. Whee! Okay. Usually, there's a quick way down, but eh. Guess not this time. Oh, well. Oh, well, I tried. Huh. Um... I could have sworn I remembered, at least out of the place that I came from, which I honestly don't remember how far back it is, that there was a uh, item in one little part of the lakeish area. But I, ooh, pistol trader. 
Just want to talk to you oh, real quick. To serve you. Oh, well, I'm glad it is. Is do I not have this? I could swear I had the steel pistol. I could swear I did. Whoops, that's not the items I wanted to go to. Yes, I do. Okay. Well. Blade. Hi. Hi there. Alrighty then. What was the thing I needed to go to again? Uh, so I think it was this direction. I want to say it was this direction. Yeah, I think it was this direction. Uh, it was right... Ah, in here. That was it. That was the thing. I had kind of ran past it. Because I was busy trying to get to the next portion of the thing. And it's only 25 gold. Alrighty. Well then. I thought it would be more important than that. Okay, well, I'm a bit over time, and there is, quite frankly, not that much more to do. Let's look at the You're rifle trader real quick. Customer. Well, I'm glad you think so. Steel flintlock rifle, uh, it's, not, it's not worth it, honestly. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to end the episode here for right now, and we shall head towards the next thing soon enough. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. Sorry, I burped in the middle of that. And share in comments. We can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat, playing games and figure out the, play, figuring out the identity of the hero of will because we should do that and my brain imploding just from hearing it apparently because i can't talk for you <laughs>